Hey everyone, in this video we're going to be showing that with ordered sets, if a set contains its upper bound, then that upper bound is in fact the supremum of the set. Now, this is specifically exercise 1.1.5, which can be found in your free real analysis online textbook, and I'll leave a link in the description so you can check that out. Let's start by listing out our hypotheses. Okay, so let S be an ordered set, and let A be a subset of S, and suppose B is an upper bound for A, and suppose that B is in A. Okay, so we're gonna do a direct proof here. The goal is to show that B is the supremum of A. Now, how do you show that an element is a supremum of a set? Well, the definition of a supremum is that the supremum is an upper bound, and it's the least upper bound. So we just need to show that B is an upper bound. Check, we did that. Uh, and we need to show that B is the least upper bound. So let Y be an upper bound of A. Then for all elements in A, A is less than or equal to that upper bound, Y. So since B is in A, that means B is less than or equal to Y. Now, why was just this arbitrary upper bound of A? And we showed that regardless of what that upper bound is, this upper bound here, B, is less than or equal to any other upper bound of A. So what we showed is that this upper bound of A is less than or equal to any upper bound of A and that means that B is the least upper bound of A. So B is the supremum of A. That was a quick proof, but it's a fun proof. I like it. Anyways, thanks everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.